Now that the channel has reached 10,000 subscribers, I'm going to be giving away Titanium White Zombies when the channel reaches 11,000 subscribers. All you have to do is drop a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications to enter. And then comment your gamer tag down below in the comments. Good luck to everyone, and let's get straight in to the video. Before we head into the video, I'd like to give a shout out to the brand new sponsor on the channel, RL Exchange. Now, RL Exchange is a great way to buy Rocket League items and credits on any platform at the cheapest prices so that you can build your dream setup. Make sure to check out the website using the top link in the description and use code TXC to get yourself 3% off your order. Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another video on episode 4 of Training from Nothing all the way up to the Titanium White Apex. I really hope you guys are enjoying the series so far, and I am going away, or I believe I will be away when this video goes up. I've pre recorded about four episodes, I do believe, of the Nothing to Something series, so you guys can have some content while I'm away. But anyway, once again, we're making so much profit this episode. Make sure to watch to the end so hopefully you can make some insane profit for yourself. Let's try and go for 150 likes on this episode. As I make in this episode we're like 150 subscribers away from 11k we might have hit it by the time this video goes up so thank you guys so much for the insane support on the channel but anyway we're gonna get straight in to the first trade of episode four so in the first trade we are going to be picking up two titanium white black markets a cobalt draco and the black oem now i do believe that the titanium white meteor storm is around 900 credits the titanium white solar flare when i bought it was around 2000 cobalt draco i'm not too sure maybe 500 credits i do believe and then the black oem i know it is 1200 credits minimum price and we're going to be picking them all up for just 4100 credits now the price is are going to be on the screen right now okay so it turns out cobalt draco is actually 700 credits so i was a little bit wrong it adds up to 4800 credits on minimum price underpaying by 700 and the cobalt draco and the black oem are going to be so easy to sell however the black markets may be a little bit harder and that's probably how i managed to underpay so much i was just saying the black markets are impossible to sell and then i just kept on negotiating trying to go lower and lower and eventually we settled at 4.1k and then i do also manage to pick up a cobalt octane and a zomba and we are paying just 700 credits now i do believe the cobalt octane is 800 credits minimum price and then the zomba roughly sells for 100 each time so we do manage to pay 700 credits and we can resell them for around 900 which means we can get 200 credits profit and maybe if we can sell the cobalt octane for mid price which is highly possible as octanes are always going to be in high demand um, i should be able to do that and that may lead to me getting 300 credits profit from that trade which is very nice we do also manage to sell the purple sparkles for minimum price 1.7k they were a little bit hard to sell but i did manage to underpay by i believe 300 or 400 credits which leads to um, a very nice amount of profit and it probably took a few days to sell but we did get the credits in the end and we also managed to pick up a cobalt fennec right here now right now it's 700 to 900 credits but they're kind of hard to sell so i just told him not that easy to sell and we did settle at 500 credits and i should be able to sell it for minimum price which will lead to another 200 credits profit which is very nice now i know we have a ton of items in the inventory right now but i'm confident none of them are gonna fall um i'm pretty sure anyway the white stride tide might fall because there's not a lot of demand uh crimson dice i'm fairly sure that will stay pretty high as well but i'm pretty sure none of it will fall too much if it if any of it does fall at all so i'm not too bothered about just keeping a ton of items in my inventory for now maybe if i had like a white octane i'd work on selling that as soon as possible just because there is a higher chance that it could drop but right now, I'm pretty comfortable with the inventory. I don't really mind buying a few more items as well because, like I said, fairly comfortable, um, and I'm pretty sure they won't go down. Maybe the stride tides. That, I mean, they'll be hard to sell, but I don't think they will go down. We do sell the black OEM for 1,200 credits. That is going to be minimum price. I usually try and buy these for around 1,000 credits and then flip it for profit, getting myself around 200 credits each time. It's a really good method because black OEMs are really high in demand. Just black, uh, black wheels in general. They look really decent, so people are going to be picking them up i do also manage to sell the cobalt draco right here we do get 700 credits i thought they were 400 earlier they're not 
they are 700 credits. They're actually quite a lot more than what I thought they were. And Dracos are really clean. I feel like they're uh, they're an underrated wheel. I would definitely use them. Anyway, we've made so much profit already. And heading into the next trade, it's actually a bit of an unusual one. I wasn't expecting to buy this Hellfire for so cheap. I'm not really sure how I did get the trade. I paid really uh, basically nothing for this item. And I still managed to get it. We did pay um, 100 credits, which I was really surprised with. Because it is 300 credits minimum price. But basically what I just said was... It's really hard to sell can you go any lower i wasn't really looking to buy it because black markets are so hard to sell right now but um 200 credits below minimum price i can easily sell it for minimum price if i just wait long enough so i thought i'd take it and see how it goes I then put up a new post on Xbox looking for group posts and I'd basically just say have Cobalt Octane want 900 credits or an item overpay. This guy joins, he has uh, he has 800 credits which is alright but like I said I'm looking for 900 and then he does add a Hex which can sell for 200 credits which is pretty decent so I take this offer and then I will be looking to get around 200 credits for the Hex. Once again it's a little bit hard to sell but it was 100 credits more than what I was looking for before so I'll take it and I probably will struggle to sell it a little bit but eventually I know I can definitely to get minimum price for this item now i've actually made quite a lot of profit with the white meteor storm i remember buying it earlier on in the series for i think 650 credits flipped it for 900 which was an easy 250 credits profit um, i'm not really sure how much we bought this one for i can't really remember but we do sell it here for 900 credits so we probably made around uh, 200 to 300 credits profit on this item as well um, because I'm not gonna lie it's hard to sell but um, I was pretty confident I could sell it it's a white black market so I thought you know what we'll risk it and we'll probably flip it for some profit but I'm mainly making a lot of my profit with painted black markets buying them from anywhere from like uh, 500 to 1500 credits under minimum in some cases and then sometimes I can flip it for minimum. Sometimes I flip it for even more than minimum. And then sometimes I just uh, I, I just take the safe option and go a little bit below minimum price. But I'm still making profit. I do also manage to pick up a pink Dominus. Now it was 5.9k at the time. And then I think like the next day or something it dropped to uh, 5.5k to 6k. Which wasn't great. But um, in the next episode you'll see that I'll sell it anyway. And it all works out fine. But um, it did actually go up after that. I sold it um, like in the dip um, when it went down I sold it and then it went back up to 5.9k minimum price and then I do believe it dropped a little bit more after that but um, yeah I can still make a little bit of profit buying it for 5.2k we should be able to sell it for at least 5.5 but anyway we just sold the Zomba off there just getting ourselves the 100 credits just being safe um, but anyway that is going to end it up for this video I really hope you guys have enjoyed make sure to drop a like subscribe and turn on post notifications um, I'm trying to get an episode out every day but right now as you're watching this I believe I will be on holiday so um, I'm not really sure how many episodes I've pre-recorded because I'm literally recording them all today hopefully I've got enough for one every day but um, I really don't think that's likely um, but yeah that is going to be it from me thank you guys so much for watching like I said make sure to drop a like subscribe and turn on post notifications we're aiming for 150 likes on this episode but anyway once again thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one peace out